Hello there, I am Tunde, a passionate instructor here at Afrinic, and I'm thrilled to be here with you today. I am excited to present this incredible Afrinic video series and take you on a journey through the fascinating history of Afrinic. Today, we'll explore the role of Afrinic and regional internet registries in managing internet number resources, shaping the ever-evolving internet landscape. Let's dive in and explore together. In today's world, the internet plays a vital role in various sectors, including government services, education, healthcare, agriculture, finance, and more. To connect devices and people, we need unique identifiers called IP addresses and autonomous system numbers, ASNs. Initially, John Postel manually managed these resources and recorded IP blocks assigned to entities in a notebook. However, with the rapid growth of the internet, a structured approach became necessary. The current system for managing IP addresses and ASNs involves collaboration between regional internet registries, RIRs, and the Internet Assigned Numbers Authority, IANA, under the Internet Corporation for Assigned Names and Numbers, ICANN. RIRs are responsible for globally managing and allocating IP addresses and ASNs, creating a stable, self-regulatory and transparent environment. Public Technical Identifiers, or PTI, allocate IP addresses and ASNs based on RIR needs, ensuring seamless resource distribution. The RIRs have evolved over time due to the growth of the internet and protocol changes shaped by ICANN's principles and input from the internet community through RFC documents produced by the Internet Engineering Task Force, IETF. The efficient allocation and management of IP addresses and ASNs in their respective service regions is crucial for the functioning of the internet. This task is performed by regional internet registries. There are five regional internet registries worldwide serving different regions. The African region is served by the African Network Information Center or AFRINIC. For the Asia Pacific region, we have the Asia Pacific Network Information Center or APNIC. The American Registry for Internet Numbers, ARIN, manages IP address allocation for North America and some Caribbean nations. RIPE NCC for Europe and some parts of the Middle East. Finally, most nations in South America are served by the Latin American and Caribbean Network Information Center or LACNIC. In 2005, AFRINIX accreditation was a significant milestone in the development of the internet in Africa. Prior to AFRINIC, African organizations had to request IP resources from other RIRs such as ARIN, RIPE NCC, and APNIC. However, the allocation policies in these regions did not always consider Africa's unique circumstances. With the establishment of AFRINIC, IP address management was brought closer to Africa's specific needs and allocation policies were adjusted to better reflect the reality of Africa. Regional internet registries are the key players in the allocation of internet number resources. They also provide critical services such as the WHOIS database, internet routing registries, IRR, Resource Public Key Infrastructure, RPKI, and Reverse DNS Services. The WHOIS database, which is a collection of allocation and assignment information, ensures IP allocation uniqueness. The Internet Routing Registry provides information about an autonomous system's routing policies and the IP address block it can originate or announce to the Internet. RPKI, on the other hand, offers resource certification to verify the legitimacy of internet number resource holders and enhancing routing security based on IETF standards. AFRINIC manages reverse DNS for IP blocks used by resource members. 
This RDNS service is crucial for the proper functioning of mail servers and mail originating applications, as well as spam mitigation. Afrinic is also actively involved in serving its community through various internet development programs. These programs include the Afrinic Fellowship Program, the Afrinic Technical Community Program, the African Research Collaboration Program, the Afrinic Diversity in ICT Program, the African Critical Infrastructure Program, and the African Internet Governance and ICT Initiative Development Program. Moreover, Afrinic offers capacity building initiatives for its technical community, including its e-learning platform with several online courses, IPv6 help desk support, and what we call deployathons. And that's a brief look into the birth of Afrinic within the RIR ecosystem. You now have an understanding of the collaboration between RIRs, ICANN, and the internet community in ensuring a robust and interconnected global network. Keep an eye out for future episodes where we explore other fascinating aspects of the internet world. Thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing you in another episode of this Afrinic video series.